2015 Tesla Model S 70D is a dual motor all-wheel drive vehicle. It gets 239 miles range on a full charge. This car does have autopilot with well the acceleration is number one being that it's instantaneous. There's no gear shifting, it's just one drive unit. There's no gears, one gear. And also uh, the use of the deceleration, the regenerative braking on uh, EV vehicles. Uh, you rarely have to use the brake. Just releasing the accelerator, the car slows down. Really, you only need to use the gas pedal. Very rarely do you use the brake. With autopilot on, the car will brake itself. You just have to pay attention and enjoy the ride. So, uh, the new version of autopilot comes out. They will. Currently, uh, the beta version 8.1 is made for the highway. It won't yet recognize stop signs, stop lights, uh, waiting for authorization and approvals for all that to pass. If and when, we do not yet know when that will be available. Autopilot version 1 that's out now is great on the highway, getting better every day, but they're not fully uh, level 4 autonomous vehicles. That's a ways away yet. It's still pretty nice, especially in traffic. Extra cameras or like extra sets of eyes on the road, seeing whatever the driver may not see. Every so often you will get a little reminder in the screen to apply light force to the steering wheel to make sure you're staying awake. If you have a vehicle in front of you, it will stop at a stoplight, but it's actually reading the car in front. So it's piggybacking off the vehicle in front of you, that's why it's stopping at the light. If there was no vehicle in front of you at a red light, currently a Tesla would just blow right through the stop sign or stop light, which is not safe. That's why it's recommended only for highway driving.